taking a chance and putting his future on the line. Zuki Safestile took out a loan to build his arcade. His intention is not to be profit driven, but to introduce the youth in the township to gaming. He believes there are career opportunities to explore that might lead to a better life for some of these youngsters. We have different industries in the same industry. So you also have a gamer, a pro gamer. You also have a commentator. You also have analysts. You also have coaches. We have, we have everything just like a normal sport. So you can choose where you want to go at any time. But it is more than just computer games. You become part of an online family. Most gamers are introverts. So when you are when you are in a space with the same-minded people, and then the personality comes out. Some some of them, they, some of the young children, their mothers are surprised when they see them here. They are alive and playing, laughing and shouting everything. It takes out their real character when they are here. That's one thing I like about the gaming, and they are happy. Festile hopes to put together a team from the township to play professional tournaments. Something the players are also aiming for. I've been playing this for quite some time and uh, you always think you're good at something until you meet someone who's, uh, who's, who's better than you. So I am hopeful that uh, we'll you know, progress a little further, but uh, I don't know. I know that the other guys are, they are good guys there yeah, and some of them are way better than me, you know. Coming into a small space like this uh, and playing a tournament, that's part of it being an e-sport, uh, so champions can come out of it. Maluma is making it possible for people that are playing at home or are not uh, privileged to have the appliances at home, they can come and be a champion at Maluma. It has been a hard slog to get to this point. Criminals have already once taken all his consoles, monitors and accessories, and he had to rebuild his project with borrowed money. But the dream remains. Sabisi Slengile, SABC News, Nkariyeha.